Well, thank you. Well, preparations are underway in case of a strike in Oregon's second largest school district. The Salem-Kaiser School District and the Teachers Union head to mediation sessions next month. And the district superintendent just announced that she will be making budget cuts and hundreds of layoffs for the next school year. Lisa Balick live in Salem tonight with the very latest on this uh, potential strike there, Lisa. Yeah, I talk with both the superintendent and the head of the teachers union. The superintendent tells me she will lay out next month details of these hundreds of layoffs and the cuts. And again, it's the same time both sides head to mediation at the bargaining table. No matter what moment we were in as a community, whether we were bargaining or whether we were not, we would be in front of you with this message. Regardless of what happens in bargaining, we are facing the loss of hundreds of people from our system who are currently working for us and on July 1st will not be. At the school board meeting, the superintendent warned of layoffs and budget cuts about to get underway. The superintendent says there's a $73 million gap between what the district spends and receives for the next school year, and the district reserve fund is going into the red. The first round of cuts, she says, she'll announce in December. They'll mostly focus on administration and central office staff. Are you going to cut teachers? It's hard to predict where we're going to cut, but I'm going to tell you where we're going to start. We're going to start with the district. In about a month, we're going to announce the first round of reductions. It will be the largest reductions in over a decade, and we are reducing every single line item that we can to protect the classroom. The superintendent says the district is getting ready in case there's a strike. But the Salem-Kaiser Education Association, the teachers union, tells me they're focused right now on mediation and working out an agreement. The teachers union, though, disagrees with the district's numbers and says there can't be cuts to classroom teachers where class sizes are already in their 30s in elementary schools. Another key issue, safer working conditions for teachers and staff. We need behavioral plans written for students so they can get more supports uh, instead of waiting all year with a student who is in crisis and injuring other students and injuring other staff. We have almost upwards of 400 injuries from students to staff since the beginning of the school year. As for a potential strike in the second largest school district in Oregon, the superintendent says they're watching what's happening in Portland and planning just in case, hoping they can avert it. And again, a lot of important dates coming up in December when it comes to mediation and making those cuts. We'll be following this closely. Live in Salem, Lisa Balick, Coin 6 News. Uh, coming up, a new twist. In